there, so today I'm doing a get ready with me. Um, I did one last time and it was um, very basic kind of like daily makeup routine. So today I'm going to do a bit more glam. I wanted to incorporate my orange lipstick as well that I got in the advent calendar. So I've already primed my face with the Flawless Original Primer from Barry M. Um, and I popped a little bit of foundation on and my skin's kind of like really nice at the moment so I'm not going to put too much on my face. Um, this is Match Perfection in the colour 100 which is ivory. Um, so I'm just going to put a little bit of concealer just to brighten up my nose. Just running out my chin. And underneath my eyes. Hello sweets. You can say hello to everyone. Say hi. Hi everyone. This is Peach. <laughs> that was a nice little... Cameo, wasn't it, Peach? Alright, I'm just going to blend that in with my fingers because Peach has happily run away with my makeup sponge, which was so lovely of her. Right, so now I will set my powder with the set my powder, use a setting powder to set my um, concealer and my foundation. And this is the um, translucent powder from uh, Makeup Revolution. I used this in my last video. Right. Next, I'll be priming my eyelids with the Asda primer. A little bit goes a long way with this. If you put too much on your eyes, they tend to feel really oily. So I just need the tiniest little bit. Just smudge that in. Right, and then I'll be going in with the palette I got out of the advent calendar. Um, first brush. I'll use that one. Hello again. You can't see her, but she's just down here. I'm just going to pop that on my eyelids. You've been good. That's your little tail. <laughs> right, so the next colour I'm going to be using is Peach's tail. <laughs> is the gold, just here. <clears throat> And I'll be popping that in my crease as a transition colour. <laughs> Just see a little rogue tail. Um, next I'll be using um, a more dense brush, this is more like a packing brush, with the, uh, the copper. I'm going to pack this on the outer third. There we go, liking that. So next I'll be using um, an eyeliner, and I haven't used black eyeliner in so, so long. I tend to use brown more, but I thought with this it would look a lot nicer. So I'm just going to do my same technique that I do with the brown. Just pop it on, and then smudge it out. Sorry if I keep looking over there, the viewfinder's there. Right, so I have a nice little pencil brush here, and I'll just smudge that out into kind of like a skinny wing. A little bit more, maybe. There we go, that's quite nice. And then do the same for this one. Most of my makeup is very smoky. I never usually have really harsh lines because um, I don't think it suits me very well. I'm going to be more spiky. There we go. Equal enough. Um, next, I will be using a smaller brush in the brown next to the copper mixed in with a little bit of the black as well and I'm just going to pop that on top of the bronze just to darken that up a little bit. So I've still got the bronze shining through but I've got the black and the brown underneath. More brown I think, a bit harsh. Right, so with a fluffy clean brush 
I'll be just blending that out so all the colours merge together and I don't have any harsh lines. A little bit more maybe. I'm losing my voice today. I'm just going to add a little bit more brown, I think, and a little bit of the gold as well, just to soften that up so it's not too harsh. Right, sorted. Um, next I'm going to curl my eyelashes. This is pretty straightforward. Everybody knows how to do it. <laughs> um, sometimes I like, to, if I want a more like bam kind of like effect, um, I like to heat them up first, either on the radiator, hair dryer, or even with a lighter. Just something like that. Um, and this is the um, Amazing Curl Mascara from Makeup Revolution. And I recently repurchased this because the one that I had, um, the lid broke on it. I dropped my whole makeup bag and so most of my um, compacts broke, which was the most annoying thing ever. And the lid fell off this. I'm just going to pop a little bit on the bottom lashes, just the tiniest little bit. Right, so that's pretty much the eyes done. Um, next I'm going to go in with a bit of bronzer. And this is from Collection, and it's the Mosaic Bronzer. It's very pinky um, and very shimmery. If I'm going for a contour, I tend to use something more matte and um, a smaller brush so it's more focused. <coughs> Sorry, I keep losing my voice. Next, I'm just going to do my brows. They're quite dark anyway. Um, so I'm just going to brush them through and add the tiniest little bit of pencil. Got a little bit into there. Oh well. <laughs> right, just brush that through. Right, on for the lipstick. Love this so much. Really pretty colour. My lips are super chapped at the moment. And there we have it. Right, so if you like this look, please give me a thumbs up. Um, if you like me, please subscribe, that would be great. And thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video um, and I'll be posting probably next Tuesday. Thank you very much. Bye bye.